Let's make the Picanta de la Casa or the Soho House Tonic a herbaceous and spicy twist on the margarita. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't know why I did that, but I've done it now, so let's move on. First thing you'll need is a Boston shaker. This is a shaken cocktail, and going into that, we have some coriander. This is gonna make that, give it the herbaceousness. You just want a big helpful pinch, something like this will be fine. Drop that right in. On top of that, we got a chiller. This is going to add to the spiciness. Spicer, herbaceous. You see it all coming together? Now what we're going to do is we're going to top cut off the top of this chilli because we will be using this as the garnish. So cut off the top, a little hat there, take it off and then just de-seed it. Knock some of the, you know, just knock it on the side of the glass, knock all the seeds out and put that to one side for later. The rest of the chilli is going to go straight into that shaker. So cut it in half and then scrape out all those seeds unless you want to get a heartburn. A heartburn? Unless you want to get a heartburn. Just scrape them out, all right? They're real spicy. They're already spicy enough, scrape them out. Cut that remainder of the chili up and then add that into the shaker along with the coriander. Then we're going to give that a little muddle. We're going to break apart the skin of that chili, mush it together with the coriander. You're not going for anything too vigorous, you don't want to puree it, we're just giving that a light muddle just to start breaking it apart, ready to be infused within our drink. After that we're going to go in with some fresh lime juice, a little bit of sour goes a long way, get yourself some fresh lime juice and pour in 30 millilitres over the top of that. Then it's agave, big helpful squeeze of agave and what's next? It's tequila, you can't do a margarita twist without tequila we're gonna go in with tequila reposado as this recipe calls for and we're gonna pour 60 milliliters right over the top of everything else so we got our lime we got our tequila we got our chili coriander and agave all that's left to do is shake it up so fill a shake with ice give it a good hard tap and give that a big shake to serve this up, we're going to do it in a rocks glass. So fill a rocks glass with ice. One more shake if good luck. Then we're going to strain it out. You want to double strain it. Single strain won't be enough because you're going to get all those little bits of coriander. If you've shook it hard enough, you're going to break up all the chiller. So you want to make sure you're not getting any of that in your drink. So strain it right out. Double strain it. And there you have it. Look at that. That is the Picasso de la Casa. Beautiful, right? Looks amazing. Remember that chilli from before, the little hat, we're going to use that just to put it on top and there you have it, also known as the Soho House Tonic, it's a moderately modern classic, it's only recently kind of rise to popularity, so try it out, you know, see what all the fuss is about, I'm going to have a little taste of this right about now and oh my gosh was it spicy, real spicy, I probably went a bit overboard on the chilli but nevertheless, absolutely delicious. Enjoy.